Welcome to Threadlife Stadium here in New York, home of the Tyrant. Boy, they really cleaned up Times Square, huh? I kind of miss the sea of wandering zombies and the stench of the open zombie landfills. And they had this nice all-you-could-shoot zombies in a barrel arcade, I remember. Yeah, that was in the good old days, Grim. Now it's just a tourist attraction. Peep shows and organized crime. <laughs> Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Philadelphia Evils go up against the New York Tyrants. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Hi again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with the only guy to ever get cut from the league for testing positive for not taking enough steroids or mutant growth hormones. Brickhead Mulligan. Hey, there was a reason for that. I had to quit taking steroids. My nuts were shrinking, and I sprouted this mini me on my shoulder. Fritz Jr., freak me out. You're a pussy. The kicker died on that play. And that's terrible. Now what do they do? Well, another player will assume the kicking role for the remainder of the game. The coach is praying he won't need a long field goal to win this one. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Second down and six. The defense has the receivers covered well. And that's a three yard gain on that pass. Third down and three. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick. It's called a zap attack. The ball kick. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just getting the... Well, that's a strange penalty called right there. I'm starting to notice that this ref likes talking, and he don't make much sense. No, but he's making a lot of dollars. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. <laughs> well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. The punter for today is being played by my kid's sister. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball's down. And it's first and ten. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. Second down and nine. with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. This 
this is your brain, and this is your brain on Brazil. Interception, and that's how you step an offense. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. I know how to set another hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? Second down in a lot. And it's first and ten. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease, first down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. run there for eight yards the offense is down to their last running back no rest for the weary the last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die second down and two and, that player has and that'll give them four more downs to punish the defense and you better believe they will First down and three. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. You gotta be fucking kidding me. If that's a penalty, they should come up here and penalize us too. Hey, don't give these reps any ideas, you idiot. Brad, I just dash. On it. They're back up here on first. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Football is a team sport, and that's why you should never think about mine unless it's that kind. <laughs> the offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing only offense. Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! First down in a mile. Ah, another interception. Easy, give this guy a... If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's gonna have the eye... 
Q of a rutabaga after that hit. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? And it's first and ten. was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Second down and nine. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. misery and says who's next one time when i was playing a guy hit me so hard i went into a dark tunnel thought i saw my grandparents waving at me in the light turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face and it's first and ten and that's another pick man oh man the defense oh devastating hit you ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And it's first and ten. Nobody can touch me an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. Any mistakes here? Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. He refuses to go down. First and ten. I don't know. Oh, what a brutal hit! Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Yikes. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. First down and forever. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down in a very lot. Receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. 
Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Man, I thought they snags. Man, what a hit that was. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. The QB looks angry at his offensive line, and I can't blame him. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Third down and forever. Either the quarterback sack count is too high or his push-up count is too low. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for you. You know what? Never mind. He's not going down. And it's first and ten. Hey, kids, do you remember getting shoved in a locker because you wore glasses? I do. Join the MFL and try Roid Rage. And, he and the defense holds that pass play to only two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Third down and long. And the ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Some things like that in the quarterback. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Finds open space is running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the rep didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck. First down, so now they have to punt. And he booted a high arcing 
rainbow. They just let that one drop and play it safe, and the defense says, we'll take it. And it's first and ten. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. Oh, I love the murder ball daddy trick. Oh, man, Bricks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. First and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Grim, what he broke free and has open field in front of him. But and the defense is on his heels. Am I the only one here who has a sudden urge to eat lobster? <laughs> Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And he's running like a... There's the cue. And he just slipped away like a greased pig. The ball's turned over and the defense has it. He's rumbling toward the end zone to score a clusterfuck. Will he make it? Run, baby! Run! When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah, he'd probably have it in a step. He could go all the way. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And they run it for a couple of yards. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. And that'll be second and eight to go. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. In a hurry up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. down give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off he is deadly in the open field and the offense quickly calls their second time out that's how you do it do what and the offense goes into their two-minute drill which coincidentally happens to be bricks match ouch what is this 80s wrestling second down and nothing. that's it that's their last time out it's them against the other team and the clock what? It seems fair. I'm gonna throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. And the quarterback throws another bow, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. Hey, man, I was here on the panel now. <laughs> Second down in a very lot.
The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, that was a vicious hit. There might not be an iron team, but this guy's eyeballs are all over the other team's helmets right now. <laughs> He scores! This guy's a game breaker! Man, he returned the kickoff with an amazing run! Leaving the kickoff team in the dust and puts up six on the board! Hey, the burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. The kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsanto Industries. Makers of great killer products like Roundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. The third quarter is about to begin, and if it's as much of a blowout as the first half was, we may see a riot in the stands. Well, that's going to happen either way, Grim. It's a $1 Red Bull Clap and Vodka Jello shot day. Yo, seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. That's a nice catch for five yards. Second down and five. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. First down. First and ten. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this outfit. Second down and two. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting or dead. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, Pop? Third down and nine. Sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defense And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! The offense is down to their last running back. 
When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit them. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. First down and one. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. I'm uh, going in circles. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Second down and more than the QB would like. Man, I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just, you just, oh man, Bricks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. Is that right, Glenn? That penalty makes no sense. Hey, something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. Second and three. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. First down and one. And he just wrestles away from that. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called straight through the uprights. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. We know this quarterback likes to play with soft balls, but the defense, they're playing with big balls and just crushed his balls. That's a lot of balls, Graham. Second down and a lot. Falls to the ground. That's incomplete. He needs to throw it when a receiver can catch it. What's he doing? And uh, groundbreaking analysis as always there, Bricks. Oh, thank you. I do my part. Hunter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. And a 
Sails out of the end zone for a touchback. The offense will get it on the 20. And it's first and 10. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. And the defense just knocked the wind out of that quarterback. <laughs> Second down in a very lot. And he's off to the races. You know, letting these dogs into the league is a slippery slope for him. First damned and vampires and mermaids, then before you know it, we're letting in cat girls. <laughs> you know, things really start to get weird at that point. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? Third down and six. Oh, great tackle. When his brain... Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Oh, was a player's favorite. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he put all of his foot into that one, and he's got a chance for a good return here. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Oh, if I was that QB, I'd be pissed. Third down and never going to happen. And the QB might as well just bury himself now because this guy's full on berserk. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And the ref is picking up a wad of singles as he runs off the field. I didn't think he got those, Grim. Didn't 
don't you see him stripping on the sidelines? He's bribed you, idiot. <laughs> That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest, I don't see a chance in hell in here. The quarterback defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. Ballsy? Stupid, maybe? I guess we'll decide after we see how this goes. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. And it's first and ten. He had nowhere to go and get a ball as a team sport, and that's why you should never think about mine unless it's that kind. Oh, that was nasty. Second down and ten. Stumbling, he could go all the way. Okay, nice and easy, like a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Ah, we are, Grim. Ah, we are. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Grim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, I don't the funeral expenses, that is. And they line up for the extra point. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy Division and weep tonight. Mm, it helps. Believe me, Grim. It helps. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. First down and seven. Huh? 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 
Dave uses strawberry fields to- You can't keep a good mutant down! <laughs> and that'll be second and eight to go. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. It's a zap attack. It's like when you shuffle your socks on a car. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Well, all the kickers are dead, so they're sending out a guy who hasn't kicked since college, where he did set a lot of records. Yeah, he hopes to make it for most concerned. And it's good. You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good. Shit again. Bricks, I'm stomping it right there. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And it, oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> Pass and catch for three. The receiver needs to break some tackles. Second down and seven. Ah, another interception. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> First down and five. The Roid Rage dirty trick transforms a player into a rampaging lunatic. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and five. Third down, and the punter is warming up. The defender says, I don't think so. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so... Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Oh, nice hit.
And it's first and ten. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. A man from prison just came out of the field. It's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can see that, Grim. First down and five. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And then put six points on the board! The defense couldn't do anything to stop a thrown out good, man! You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. Fumble! You've got to protect the ball better than that. He's at the 10. Here comes the defense. You think a robot would do the electric slide, wouldn't you, Grim? It's in their programming to reject that particular move, Bricks. Two on the nose. That and, uh, well, the robot. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stopping time. That's why the And they just popped his eyes into the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting. Or dead. Or worse. <laughs> Second down in a lot. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Grim, what a minute. Oh, with a brutal hit. First and ten. And he's perfect pass and the score. Bring your back to me. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And 
And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. Second down in. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. Third down, and that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of that constant, relentless advance? If only it was as easy... Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. First down and nine. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry-up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8, the greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's pleading with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And here comes the extra point attempt. Goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. And he's all Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. I'm a high-scaled shiver. I am a hell of a Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's 
good. The New York Tyrants lose the game. The score says it all, but it wasn't even that close. They got blown out at home. Fans left by halftime to forget the game and start watching the new game of Bones on NBO. And I watched that on my phone, too. Oh, let's go down to the field and see how badly the MVP rubs it in. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.